Well, Coach Pash, three points a season low for you, but 30, a magical number. This is your 30th consecutive win, second straight championship. Congratulations. What did well, it take for your team to get uh, You know, first of all, you only have to win by one, and that's, uh, that's what we talk about. But, uh, you know, what a wonderful day when you get to do this for a living in a place like this and, pro and proclaiming Jesus Christ as your Savior. And uh, you get to bring a bunch of tremendous young people along with you. Talk about your squad, your young men, uh, how they play today, and the pride that you have. Yeah, we're really proud. You know, um, we played well enough. Um, we, I didn't like some of the things we did early, but uh, I think we played a really clean second half, and uh, that's probably what gave us a little bit of room of separation there, Dan. Your quarterback joined history. Jackson got over 4,000 yards for a season. Uh, great receiving core along with him. A great performance there. Yeah, you know, the thing that we talk about is, is a program. Uh, we know offensively you can't stop one guy, and uh, Jackson's been tremendous as a sophomore, uh, but he's got, uh, he's got a lot of really good skilled players around him, and uh, just a, a tremendous offensive line. And then, you know, you don't want to leave out our defense because our defense, uh, I think, has only given up three scores the entire uh, tournament now. You hit on it quickly with community, but what is it like to have these fans behind you to support these guys? Well, you know, this is, uh, it's all about, it's, uh, it's fanatics, you know. It's, it's about fans. It's about the community. Uh, we don't do this for ourselves. It's about uh, everybody that's invested in this. Uh, you know, one of the things I talked about this week is the, just what it is to be sustainable as a program, and uh, it doesn't happen without everybody. And uh, for that, we're thankful. Congratulations. Go enjoy this with your guys. Thank you.